Mr. Jason Dill, Jason Dill, how you doing there, mate? How you doing? Are you all right? Hi, Tim. Nice to meet you. Uh, I, I like that my cue came in at Inspire Nothing. That's Ins my favorite uh, <laughs> quote or, or adage or, or uh, yeah. words to live by. Hey, I can't see you. Oh, you can't see me? Uh, you should be able to, Matt. Can you look into that? There's nothing to see. There's nothing to see. I look like a slob today. Well, I look it, like it, 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 it's it's surreal enough to do the show where I feel like I'm talking to my fucking self. But I, whatever suits <laughs> your fancy well, over there in Hollywood. I look like I look like Michael Keaton in the third act of Mr. Mom. OK, folks. <laughs> Um, He's just holding the baby over the over the hand dryer. Yeah. <laughs> so, Mr. Dill. Hey, Matt, Matthew, Matthew, thank, not to cut you off, Tim. Matthew, thank you for reaching out to me. I, I really appreciate it, and I'm a, I'm, I'm extremely nervous, and I'm a, I'm a big fan of the show. And hi, hi, Doug, and uh, hi, Vic, and Tim. It's it's, it's nice What's to up, meet man? you after uh, watching you uh, in TV Land all these years. Oh well, that's, listen, you know, I'm a puppy dog. I'm nothing to be worried about. You can. Uh, we're gonna, you, you know, you. I don't. I'm not. Here's here's the deal with you. Um, I'm just a human being. You came onto our radar when you said unbelievably kind things about the Office Hours show on another podcast, on a skateboarding podcast, boarding a boarding po a skate podcast. You know, one of them board talk shows. They talk about boarding and getting talk about, down and going. Talk about boring. Boarding. I mean, sorry. Well, um, talk about boring. <laughs> I know most of most of the people watching right now is like this guy's a fucking professional unicycler. Yeah. What? So tell me about your you you you're a professional skater, and now Doug is obsessed with skating. He skateboards. He's got a half pike in his base in his uh, backyard and everything. Um, no, I saw I saw when he was feeding the squirrels in a. I don't know, Doug. Did you see that video I, I sent to Matthew of the? Squirrel eating a fig Newton. That I know you had a mesmerized. you had a superior squirrel report, which you know made me a little jealous. <laughs> did you, did you give honest. him the, the fig Newton, or did he find that? Well, himself? the problem with Doug, if anyone's not familiar, Doug has been has started putting out squirrel reports. I guess on a daily basis, or what is we going to? What are we looking at? A weekly or? It's a daily basis. The, the, the problem with that first squirrel report is no squirrel in it. Well, Tim, it's sometimes God damn it. it's Tim, about the you took search. The words out my fucking mouth. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you know, it's it's about the search of for the squirrel, and you know, other things arise, and it's just a way to start the day. Is just see. so. Hey, I don't know about you guys, but um, I'm fucking gearing up for a pretty bitchin' summer. I'm talking about waves. I'm talking about the beach. I'm talking about babes, cold cokes, high fives, volleyball. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> Um, can you skateboard? Do you skateboard on the beach? Do you uh, do you have special wheels for sand, or how do you how do you? Yeah, they're called sand wheels, and you uh, it it you it takes you know you get about you know a foot per half hour. All right, that was so a bad joke. So Jason, <laughs> do you, are you you're a competitive boarder? Is that how how does it work? What is your what is your no, life? No, Tim, like? I'm only competitive in the bedroom. Hey oh. <laughs> Hey, that's a great fucking record. <laughs> that's a my great favorite record. thing that you do. Yeah, let, let, let's do this. Tim, let, hold on, hold on, Jason. I want to. I want to steer the conversation away from your career to you talking about our show. And in, in other words, I don't want to talk about skateboarding. I want to talk about you guys. You guys, because I like to meet people that make me laugh. I like to have fun. There you go. So, how did you become introduced to the show, uh, Office Hours? Here, I got the internet. <laughs> got it i love to laugh i love to smile so you've been basically offline for i guess your whole life until recent very recently well till yeah till i found out about your guys's glorious show and then i became a a patriot and as a patriot i get to watch the extra half hour that you guys phone in oh yes and, we have uh, a patriot you know, that's a good name for it guys patriot. A, a patriot that we phone a patron in. a patron idiot <laughs> i'm totally kidding <laughs> see i feel pressure this is a comedy show don't you don't hey, i got to tell you what nobody what, what? wants no listen no let me t teach you a little bit about 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 life <laughs> nobody wa is looking for you to be funny we got the comedy covered dill you just got to be hey. yourself brother <laughs> No, I got I, no, Doug behind I, I, I me. I mean, man. you're 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 getting uh you're getting only what I can be. I'm even drinking single pop in care of uh, <laughs> being on your show. That's single pop. Well, listen. Do you think it's too late for me to pick up skateboarding? I'm 44. Um, I'm overweight and I have no sense of balance. 
Um, I recently, about four years ago, broke my wrist uh, roller, roller skating. Not very healthy boy. Well, I broke, I broke this wrist uh, four times. So, you know, you Jesus. and me are in the same club as far as that goes. But I don't know. You know, skateboarding's like skateboarding is like UFC, but you're by yourself. Not that I'm a fan of uh, the unified fighting chucks. No, I, this is but, the, this, uh, wait, hold on, hold on, Jason. This is the direction I want to take the show. I'm going to kind of talk. Go for it, Tim. I'm going to talk quietly, and I'm going to talk about uh, f- ultimate fighting or uh, mixed martial arts. And, oh man, and, I didn't mean <laughs> to go there. I'm just talking about it hurts, just like roller skating hurts, man. Yeah. But so you get you break bones and you and you soldier on. See, as soon as I broke my wrist, I said I'm not leaving the house. I don't care to go down steps. I'm constantly in fear of breaking more bones. And I it was such a it was such a disruptive experience that I just thought, okay, I just played that one card. I played my my breaking of, of a bone card. And now if something if if my leg breaks or my neck breaks, I'm done. It's it for me. I'm toast. So I try to. It's, it's it for me too if I break my leg or my neck. But no, I don't. I don't know. It's a, you know if you want to if you want to ride a fucking skateboard in your forties, I mean, go for it. But at the same time, there's probably plenty of other shit you could be doing. There. I stepped on one of those. You know those uh, things that have wheels. <laughs> Those things that, that that have motors that you just step on. What's I've never been on one. Well, you know what I mean? It has a motor and it, you plug it in and then it goes. It's sort of like a like a lime scooter. No, it's okay. it's like it doesn't have a handle. It's the thing that it's the thing that Mike Tyson fell down on. Remember yeah. he fucking ate oh. shit on it. Yeah, that thing. I don't know. They call it. What do the kids call them? A hoverboard. conveyor belt. Hoverboard. 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 Oh, the hoverboard. Yeah, I stepped on one. Very of those. 2018. I stepped on one of those and went immediately went f- back right backwards. <laughs> My head was about six inches from slamming into a plate glass window. Hi, <laughs> what? What were you? You were doing it in church? I was doing it in plate tr- glass window. <laughs> That's a stained glass window, Jason. Dar- a stained glass window. Jason, are you? Uh, are you in L.A.? Is that? Are you an L.A. boy? I'm. I'm, I'm your guys' neighbor, kind of. I'm in Pasadena. I, oh, sweet. I, I moved to Pasadena about three months ago. Oh, it's beautiful over there, man. It's be- you go to. It's re- great. Uh, all I do is uh, walk and. Read books while I walk all over uh, town here. Do you read the book um, like on an audio book, or do you are you no, reading? No, you can't an actual read an book? audio book, silly. But I mean, you can't read an audio book. You're holding a no, book. No, I, 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 I actually it, it sounds wild, but I walk and I read, and and, and it, it it really works. It, I'm I'm really into it. I cover about five miles a day, and um um. Yeah, I, I, that's it's 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 the highlight of my fucking day these days. Is to, I get up and go walk and read the goddamn book, and I come back to the fucking squirrels. What kind of goddamn books are you reading? So, wait a minute. Uh, wait a minute. As fu- what? What? Hold on. Well, can you recommend one I, book? I I think it's something you guys can talk about offline. I don't know if anybody needs to hear the this, this bibliography from this show. This fascinating. Doug, I want you hey, to Tim, use your- I'm just talking about how I fill my day in a pandemic. Sorry, it's not more <laughs> fucking exciting. Next time, maybe maybe get Tony Hawk. Well, he's listen. talking about hanging out with Jack Black. D- D- Dale, you calm the <laughs> F down. You slow down <laughs> now. This is my goddamn show, goddamn it. You tell me. <laughs> no, wait a minute. I want to. I want to. I do want Doug to have an opportunity to ask yes, you a question. Got... But Doug, please make it skateboarding related. This is your opportunity <laughs> to get advice or get insights from one of the masters. Oh my God. Go ahead, Doug. I, <laughs> um, I don't. I don't really have a question as far as that goes. I, I'm more interested in the in you know what he's reading, not what he's. Okay, fine. Do, what, okay. Um, what are one? What is one book that you're reading, Jason? Then we can move things along. I'm reading right now. I'm reading Education of a Felon by Edward Bunker. Okay. And, uh, and I've, I've read a couple of Steinbeck books Thank you. during the pandemic and a little bit of James Baldwin and a little bit of the Mike Tyson book. But You're talking my hey, language. I'll tell you see? something. Reading is I, fundamental. I, can, I just connected you guys. I... First of all, East of Eden is, my, I think, my favorite book ever written. I don't know if you're reading East of Eden. You read that one? Well, I have, and I, I just read Sweet Thursday and Wayward Bus uh, in the last couple huh. months. Um, 
Hmm. But East of Eden, that's a big one. Grapes oh. of Wrath is tough to finish. I only read, I don't, you know what? I only read big books. I only read like, you know, 500ers, you know. I, <laughs> I only read I, David Foster Wallace, you know. I don't I'm read really the small advanced. Yeah, I don't read the small books, you know. It's not really. Hey, but me. Tortilla Flat, Tortilla Flats by Steinbeck, it's a very small book. It's a great book. That's a beautiful book. And it then is, I was yeah. in a James Baldwin play uh, when I was in college. I was in a, a James Baldwin play. That, it was a. I think it was a story he wrote that was trans that was turned into a play called Giovanni's Room. I masturbate a lot. No, not Giovanni. Right. Wow. Uh, yeah, Giovanni's Room. Is that right? Yeah. I played a, That's... a gay man living in Paris uh, who was in in love with an, an African man, and you know. That's beautiful. It was a beautiful experience. Hey, does 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 Al really stand for Albert? Sucking? I never knew that. Albert Pacino. No, I think it's Alfonso. It, Alfonso. It sounds so funny to say Albert Pacino. And the guy that does that, wow, kudos. Fucking, it's so funny. Weird Al Pacino. Weird Al Pacino. Weird Al Pacino. <laughs> Get him on next, that Weird Al Pacino. Are you able like, to like, like during the pandemic? Or What's this, like, Doug? Is your mic off? Vic, you're, you're coming in weird. Who? What's going on? Doug. Doug. Am I not, no one's here I'm not me? saying anything. Vic's coming in Yo. quiet. So, yeah, Vic's coming in a little quiet. What are you saying, Vic? I'll, I'll, I'll uh, relay. Are the skateboard parks open? Are the skateboard parks open D during uh, the Dale. pandemic? Can I call you Dale? <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, that's fine. I didn't pick the name, but but Vic, I don't give a fuck. You don't get, you don't give a fuck about that. <laughs> You'll skate anywhere. You'll, yeah. No, I feel I feel bad for the yeah. young people. Like if I was if I was in my twenties and you know really going for it and shit, I'd I'd probably be freaking out right now. But I'm not in my twenties. But you know they they filled the Venice skate park with sand. Because, right. you know, uh, you know, that's what true fucking Americans do. You know, they hey, listen, we all have to sacrifice. We all have to hey. let things hey. put right. things on. Pause. Speaking of Steinbeck. Grow, exactly. We all can learn. Um, Jason, <laughs> I got to move. I got to move the show along. It's a pleasure to talk yes, to you. Yes, you do. And we got a very special uh, experience happening right now. We're going to try this. And I think you'll look forward to it. Jason, you're a friend of the show. You're a friend of mine now. What an honor. <laughs> I look forward to uh, it. If you ever want to skate my quarter pipe, let me know. Okay. T it, 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 Doug, that's called a half pipe. No, it's, it's all in your backyard. Oh, it's, it's a quarter. It's a quarter pipe. Doug has Wait, just you, you, been... so you built just half of the. Half wow, of that's quarter, cool. Half of a half it. is a quarter. That, that, <laughs> Okay, thank you. Gotta you got to build one of them loops. Thank you very hey, much. Hey, Tim, thank yeah. you so much. I appreciate it. Keep okay. the show moving. Be safe. Uh